Today we were here in Konovitz, the Czech Republic. It had three changes of the engine. It's really familiar with Lamborghini car. You really get spotted. The most uh, powerful ex and expensive uh, version. We try to stall this uh, aircraft. The price starts from uh, 130,000 euros and goes up to 350k euros. Hi guys, I'm pilot Nikita and today we're here in Konovitz, the Czech Republic at BRM Aero Factory. Um, the factory was uh, found, it's a family business, it was found by uh, father and son Milano and uh, Martin Bristella. Uh, the factory was uh, founded in 2009, it counts uh, 130 uh, workers and um, you can see behind uh, the aircrafts which are produced here. Today I'll be making test flight of uh, Bristol B23 and uh, Bristol uh, Classic, so uh, come with me. At Bristol factory you can find seven different types of aircrafts uh, such as uh, Bristol B23 which is a certified version of uh, Bristol aircraft and the B23 Turbo which uh, has a uh, Rotex 915 uh, turbocharged. So uh, Bristol Classic which is uh, uh, the category of uh, ultralight, uh, non-certified. Bristol TDO, which has a uh, tailwheel. Bristol B8, which has uh, a high wing, uh, that's a new version of Bristol aircraft. Also Bristol RG, which has a retractable uh, landing gear. And uh, Bristol uh, Energic, which has an uh, electrical uh, power plant. As of today, Bristol factory counts more than 1,000 aircrafts delivered worldwide. First Bristol aircraft was produced in 2009 and um, by today this aircraft is still flying at the flight school. It has uh, total uh, flight hours of 5000. It had three changes of the engine and the only maintenance was light maintenance which shows that this aircraft uh, has unlimited lifetime if you maintain and um, use this aircraft properly. Another key feature of uh, Bristol aircraft is their design. You can select a variety of uh, different colors upon your choice, but Bristol involved a special Italian aircraft designer who developed seven, actually, variety of different designs which are used only on Bristol aircraft. Every time you arrive at a new location, new aerodrome, you really get spotted because the aircraft looks amazing. Especially this aircraft is really familiar with Lamborghini car. The Bristol aircraft features predominantly all metal design, offering durability and strength and maintaining low weight at the same time. Both wings and the fuselage are made of uh, strong metal, which provides uh, safety in turbulence and uh, strong wind conditions. Bristol aircraft can be equipped with a variety of uh, Rotex engines, such as uh, Rotex 912 ULS, uh, uh, which has uh, carburetors, uh, and um, Rotex 912 IS, uh, which has uh, injection. Uh, both of these engines are 100 to 110 horsepower. Another engine which can be installed is Rotex 915, uh, which is a turbocharged uh, 140 horsepower and the uh, Rotex 916, the brand new Rotex engine, which has 160 horsepower. Uh, also, Bristol aircraft can be equipped with a variety of uh, blades. Uh, the cheapest uh, version uh, of the blade is uh, Fiti blade. Then you can go for carbon blade uh, made by Duke or EA Prop. And uh, the most efficient and the most expensive is uh, MT propeller. Both of these um, blades uh, have a variety of uh, constant uh, speed propeller and uh, fixed, which uh, can be constant speed propeller can be adjusted in flight by, uh, by the pilot and the uh, fixed one can be adjusted on the ground. So here I have uh, the most uh, powerful ex and expensive uh, version of uh, Bristol B23. This version is equipped with a Rotex 915 engine, uh, turbocharged, uh, which um, has 140 horsepower, 
uh, with the maximum cruise speed at 10,000 feet of uh, 140 knots. The maximum range of this aircraft is uh, 1,500 kilometers with average fuel consumption uh, of um, 20 liters per hour. Um, it can be uh, flown as on MOGAS, uh, which is a simple uh, benzene which, which we use uh, for our cars, and uh, of course, Avgas. This aircraft uh, can be used for uh, as day VFR and night VFR flights. Also, I can spot that this version is equipped with the most efficient and uh, performant blade, which is a uh, constant speed uh, propeller uh, made by MT. Also, I can spot that this aircraft is equipped with the most performant avionics, which are made by Garmin and uh, available on the market. Uh, it has two uh, G3X uh, screens. It has uh, Garmin Autopilot, Garmin Transponder, Navigation. Well, best what is available on the market, uh, this aircraft has. Uh, another feature that this aircraft has is a ballistic system, uh, parachute which is used also on uh, Cyrus uh, aircrafts. Um, if you're in a situation where you cannot uh, perform an emergency landing, you can just uh, pull the emergency uh, lever and the parachute system will land you uh, safely with the whole aircraft. This aircraft has um, EASA type uh, certificate as it is certified. The aircraft which I have for a test flight today is uh, in a grey color. The aircrafts which you already saw in the hangar were like multicolor uh, with different, uh, let's say, design. But I would like to say that this aircraft in a mono color looks really sexy, especially this shark part looks like on a Mercedes AMG. Here on the parking area, you cannot find uh, the Bristol aircraft without the shoes. Uh, this part increases and improves the aerodynamics and efficiency of the aircraft. You can see that all of them, apart from that one. And this version is RG version, which means uh, retractable gear. Um, in terms of safety, if it doesn't come off uh, it doesn't retract automatically. It has um, the emergency uh, feature which pushes them hard and uh, opens uh, hydraulically. Even if this aircraft is a low wing aircraft and uh, some people say that uh, due to low wing uh, you have uh, some restrictions in uh, visibility, I can uh, totally disagree with that. Uh, with the upslope canopy, you can uh, perfectly have a better view while landing. Also, uh, you can see better the traffic around you. Also, if you fly in the um, area where there are loads of mountains, uh, you have re a better view than on a high wing. And if you need to see something on the ground, the maneuverability of this aircraft uh, is so good that you can easily bank the wing down and you have a perfect view. Some people say that uh, during a hot summer sunny day uh, in the aircraft uh, which has uh, a canopy inside the cabin it's like a sauna. Uh, I can agree with that but we still found a solution to make it less uh, let's say less warm inside the cabin and protect the passenger and the pilot by using a tinted glass which stops the UV light and uh, well it's uh, less warmer in the cabin. This aircraft has amazing interior and its design. It has the most spacious uh, cabin in its class. Uh, it's 130 centimeters wide. Uh, my height is 175 uh, centimeters and uh, I can uh, fit myself easily and uh, very I, I feel very comfortable. It also has the support for your knees from um, left uh, and right position. Also, you have another storage here where you can keep your phone, sunglasses, batteries for your headset and so on. Another great feature is that it has... Um, 
adjustable uh, paddles. For example, if your height is uh, 180, 190, you can easily just uh, adjust the paddles uh, to the back and uh, feel as comfortable as uh, I feel. This aircraft can cover a variety of missions, uh, such as uh, flight training. Uh, it will be a perfect training aircraft uh, for any flight school, uh, for uh, LAPL, uh, PPL, uh, and uh, night VFR, and even for IFR training. It has really solid landing gear, uh, especially the spring leaves and the front shock absorber, which will uh, make this aircraft lasts uh, for a really long time, even after some hard landings uh, while training. Another uh, mission could be um, using this aircraft uh, for a traveling purpose, because um, um, if the aircraft is equipped with Rotex 915 or 916, it can uh, fly up to cruising speed of 140 knots uh, with uh, average fuel consumption of um, 25, 27 liters per um, hour. Another mission is flying for fun. If you're um, such a pilot uh, who comes uh, during the weekend uh, to the aerodrome to fly around uh, uh, with, with your friends, uh, you can go for Bristol uh, Classic uh, equipped with a Rotex 912 and really enjoy this lovely aircraft. Another mission, if your Bristol aircraft is equipped with the powerful Rotex 915 or 916, is the towing device. There is additional option installing the towing device, which allows you to tow uh, different objects such as banners or even gliders. As you can see, um, here is a mechanism which can be controlled um, uh, by a special lever inside the cockpit. Also, you have the camera, which uh, shows you everything what's going on uh, at the back, displayed on your Garmin G3X. If you're planning to use uh, Bristol aircraft uh, for traveling, it has a really spacious uh, baggage compartment. Three, three baggage compartments, uh, which are located in the left wing and right wing. Here you can place up to 20 kgs uh, of baggage. Um, you can easily fit here a medium-sized bag in the right wing as well. And um, behind the seats we have another baggage compartment which can uh, fit up to 16 uh, uh, kgs of uh, load. The key figures after uh, performed the uh, test flight on uh, Bristol B23 with uh, Rotex 915 uh, are the maximum cruise speed in the horizontal flight, uh, which I was able to reach today was uh, 132 knots at flight level uh, 9 or 5. Also, uh, we uh, managed to keep the optimum rate of climb with 1,400 feet per minute. Also, I'd like to mention that this aircraft has service ceiling up to flight level 180. We try to stall this uh, aircraft um, with uh, zero flaps and the value of uh, stall was um, around um, 51 knots. And then uh, stall with uh, flaps uh, was at 45 knots. If you fly on the economic uh, settings. Uh, you can uh, fly with fuel consumption of up to 18 liters uh, per hour, keeping the uh, cruise speed of uh, 220 kilometers, which is around 110 knots. For uh, takeoff and landing, uh, you can, um, the minimum, uh, let's say, airfield uh, runway distance uh, would be 400 meters. You can use both concrete and uh, the grass uh, airfield, uh, no problem at all. This aircraft can land literally anywhere. Now let's talk about the prices. Um, if we talk about the certified version of uh, Bristol B23, the price starts from 220k euros and goes up to 350k euros uh, depending on 
the engine which uh, you select and some other options. As this aircraft is uh, certified, you don't have uh, much chance to change something apart from the color and some additional options. Now, if we talk about the price uh, for Bristol uh, Classic, the ultralight version, the price starts from uh, 130,000 euros and goes up to 250, 280,000 euros, depending on the engine uh, design, uh, interior and other configuration. If we talk about the RG version, the price goes up to 310,000 euros with full options uh, and the most performant uh, 916 engine. Also, the price might be affected by the design which you will select. The most expensive uh, design is uh, Italian paint design, which costs uh, 10,000 euros. Uh, also, if you select uh, two color design, uh, it's a bit cheaper and the cheapest one is uh, when the aircraft has only one color. Same with the interior, there are three different options uh, of interior and uh, depending on uh, which material is used, uh, uh, the price goes higher and higher. Another additional uh, option on Bristol aircraft is uh, certified exhaust uh, silencer. For example, your aerodrome is um, located um, in a congested area of uh, different houses and uh, your neighbors do not like loud aircrafts. We have a solution for you and it will definitely solve your problem. As an owner of a Bristol aircraft, you will face a certain uh, operation costs. Uh, if we take into account the rent, fuel, oil, other maintenance expenditures uh, and the cost of the uh, aircraft, you will uh, fly approximately uh, 150 hours per year. Uh, the cost of one flight hour will be starting from 65 to 75 euros uh, per hour as an owner. Uh, if you buy the aircraft um, due to the increase uh, of prices of avionics and uh, other components, aircrafts become more expensive every year by five to seven percent. So you have an option, a chance to even uh, win or uh, keep the same amount invested in the aircraft uh, after one year of uh, flying. Fly with comfort and safety. Choose Bristol.